द रेलवे लाइन कनेक्टिंग भैरवी इन मिजोरम विथ सिल्चर इन आसाम द सेम वे इट इज नाइनटीन थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड फिफ्टी फाइव करोड़ डेवलपमेंट ऑफ न्यू ट्रैक्स एंड डबलिंग ऑफ द एग्जिस्टिंग लाइन्स द सेम वे इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द टेलीफोन कनेक्टिविटी नियरली फोर थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव विलेजेस ऑफ द रीजन हैज बीन टेकन फॉर अ बेटर कनेक्टिविटी इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द नॉर्थ ईस्ट द हाउस होल्ड रीजन बींग इलेक्ट्रीफाइड दीन दयाल उपाध्याय ग्राम ज्योति योजना Three thousand three hundred and eighty-seven crore rupees have been spent, and five hundred and seventeen villages of Mizoram have been electrified under this scheme. The same way, eight new projects worth thirty thousand thirty thirty crore forty-two lakh has been sanctioned for the hundred percent electrification of Mizoram. a total of four power projects and 239 power projects are sanctioned and 3200 crores have been uh, sanctioned for that if i talk about the completion of the turial turial uh, uh, hydroelectric project we know that it was pending since 1990 which under the leadership of prime minister modi it was uh, completed and closed for aizol smart city project 367 crore rupees have been sanctioned if i talk about the empowerment of women empowerment of the people of this area in garib kalyan an yojana in mizoram 6.6 lakh people are getting 5 kilo rice or 5 kilo wheat along with 1 kilo pulses if i talk about the water connection 1.1 lakh people have been given tap water connection which is now 100% connection in mizoram if i talk about ujwala 33000 people have been given gas cylinder connections along with the sub, uh, the the gift of 200 rupees per cylinder and along with the subsidy of 100 rupees if i talk about jandhan yojana 3.7 lakh people are benefited if i talk about the pradhan mantri swachh abhiyan 46000 toilets have been constructed and now mizoram is total defecation free so that is one thing if i talk about aishman bharat 1.9 lakh families means 1 lakh 90000 families have been the beneficiaries of it the same way if i talk about pradhan mantri awas yojana 7000 houses has been constructed under aishman bharat now coming to the sankalp of bhartiya janata party i would like to share with you that bjp vision document says that we launch an operation drug free mizoram to curb the drug addiction amongst the youth across the state we will launch a mission mizoram edu upgrade education upgrade and zirlai simathavana mission which is the budget of uh, to the tune of 250 crores and 350 crores respectively to revamp the existing government schools colleges with the state of art facilities we also commit with our vision that we will establish a mizoram sports academy which will be fully funded and with scholarship for aspiring athletes with a strong emphasis on football wrestling weightlifting hockey and badminton we will launch a mizoram olympic mission to establish mizoram as a leading sporting state and mizo youth to make substantial contributions in the medal tally of the olympia the same way we will collaborate with the central government to upgrade the Zoran Medical College as a regional institute of medical sciences rents we are going to work the same way we will introduce queen ropoi liani women empowerment scheme whereby every girl child will be offered a cumulative financial assistance to the tune of 1.5 lakhs for the girl we will introduce 33% reservation 
for women in the government jobs for women. If we talk about the infrastructural development, Mizoram Urban Development Infrastructure Mission with a corpus of 400 crores to foster the development focusing on providing reliable electricity, efficient urban, reliable and renewable energy, electricity, efficient urban connectivity and improved roads. Following the success of the Mamit in their aspirational district, we will collaborate with the central government to include Siaha as the aspirational district. <laughs> Mizoram Rural Infrastructure Development Mission with a corpus of 950 crores to ensure holistic development of all villages. This is called inclusive growth, inclusive development. If we talk about health, we will double the family annual health insurance coverage of Aishman Bharat from 5 lakhs to 10 lakhs under Aishman Bharat. We will increase, in, for the farmers, we will increase the annual financial assistance of 6,000 rupees in the Pradhan Mantri Kisan Samman Nidhi and it will be increased to 8,000 rupees per, per year. Per year per we will introduce Mizo Agri Infra Mission with an investment of 1,000 crores to revamp the agricultural infrastructure of Mizoram at all levels. If we talk about, we will establish special investigation team to probe all irregularities and corruption in implementation of SEDP. This way. We will collaborate with the central government and Assam government to resolve the long-standing border dispute and, Assam, and safeguarding the interests and rights of Mizoram residents that we assure. We will overcome all fallacies on corruption surrounding the SEDP scheme. We will launch Lotus Scheme, Livelihood, Opportunity, Transformation and Upliftment Scheme. And the issue of the Lotus Family ID cards are to all eligible families aiming to improve at the quality and the livelihood. Quality of livelihood. If we talk about the cultural development, the, we will grandly celebrate Mizoram's Chapchar Kut, Paul Kut and Meem Kut festivals showing our rich culture and traditions. We will work closely with central government to ensure that an assistance of 22,500 crores is utilized effectively and efficiently towards making Mizoram as one of the top economies in the Northeast. <laughs> After years of neglect towards the economically viable tourism sector by the government, we will revamp the brand of Mizoram tourism, mystical Mizoram with corpus of 250 crores. BJP has believes in divine and not in divide intentions of the Northeast. We believe in divine Northeast, not in divide Northeast. And therefore, we believe in DTH, which is di uh, development, transformation, and harmony among the people. Friends, this is how we want to see to it that uh, uh, how we are going to go forward and see to it that uh, the holistic development of Mizoram takes place and a lot of financial support is given to the Mizoram for the people of Mizoram. As we all know that mainstreaming has been done and we have to go forward in that very direction. With these words, I once again, through you, request the people of Mizoram to support Bharatiya Janata Party, to support Bharatiya Janata Party candidates, so that we are able to see to it that Mizoram effectively and efficiently grows forward with the intention of inclusive growth of Mizoram, and Mizoram becomes one of the leading states in Northeast. Thank you very much.